Well, hello everybody. I am Jay Leonard Jay, and today we are checking out the Vapor Trail Deluxe by Seymour Duncan. <music> Well, ladies and gentlemen, if you are among those who think that analog delays just sound absolutely brilliant, but can kind of be a bit of a one trick pony compared to modern delays, this might be the pedal that changes your mind. This is the Vapor Trail Deluxe by Seymour Duncan, and it has all the goods. So uh, you will have an expression pedal out. You do get trails for bypass if you want it, presets, and even an insert so you could put effects on your trails specifically. But where this thing does get a little bit crazy is uh, with this little mode knob over here. Uh, basically, you can get different tap subdivisions as well as four really unique analog crazy sounds that you really don't hear in the typical delay pedal, uh, ranging from weird pitch sequencers and octave jumpers and all kinds of wonderful analog squeezy goodness. So what I'm going to do today is I'm gonna grab myself my Fender Telecaster with my tone-specific J-Mod signature pickups, and I'm gonna put it into this uh, Tone King Imperial, and uh, let's just start tweaking knobs on this tiny little box. Well, this pedal is capable of a lot of really crazy sounds, so let's just dig right into it. Uh, mix, repeat, and time, basic analog delay functions. We have the tap tempo with different modulations. So let's just get a nice dotted eighth note delay. This is my guitar. And then this is the vapor trail. <laughs> There's also modulation on board with these two knobs. Goes really intense actually as you get up. Now, obviously, just that alone with the three presets, you can get a lot of crazy sounds, but really the magic of this pedal is in these extra modes you get. So let's just dig into these extra modes. Uh, my go-to right here is micro delay because it shortens the delay time. So on the upper end, if I take the repeats down, I can get a really nice slap back delay sound. <laughs> Now, if I go really, really low, the since the delay time's already really quick to begin with, we start getting some really tight sounds to get almost in like a double tracker kind of sound here. <laughs> Thank you. 
Now let's start adding a little bit of modulation. Now we got kind of like a chorus sound. Now let's turn up some feedback, turn down even more, and let's get some like flangery sounds. Awesome. Next mode, we have pitch sequence. And now we have a pitch sequencer uh, that changes the two knobs here. This knob now uh, chooses how many pitches is in our sequence. And then this is the length. Let's go play with that a little bit now. Runway is pretty much a standard delay, but when I hold down on the tap, I start oscillating or I start increasing the feedback on the pedal. <laughs> The last of the special modes is called Pitch Bender, and uh, this actually is my favorite mode. This is where things get really neat. I'm gonna switch over to that. Now, uh, when the depth is below noon, the pitch will go down. If it goes above noon, the pitch is gonna go up, and then the rate kind of picks how quickly it goes down or how quickly it goes up. So let's go down first. <laughs> For our last sound, we're gonna do something a little bit funky. I'm gonna play with the expression pedal out and uh, this insert loop here. So in the expression pedal out, I could pretty much program any of these five knobs to work. I just have it on repeats for now. And in the insert loop, uh, what that does is it puts any effect you want on just the trails. And I decided to put an envelope filter from the Foos, which is another Seymour Duncan pedal. Uh, some people like to use octaves for ethereal sounds, but let's just hear what it sounds like with the envelope filter and let's get to work. Let's hear what it sounds like.
And that is The Vapor Trail by Seymour Duncan. Well, that is it. That's the video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to the page if you haven't already. Check out the links in the description below. And if you want to hear my review on The Vapor Trail Deluxe, please check it out on Patreon. I do all my reviews sponsored by the Patreon supporters over there on Patreon. And then all my demos and tutorials, lesson stuff right here on YouTube. Uh, my question for the subscribers today is, when it comes to analog delays, specifically analog, do you like the fact that the, you know, the classic analog delay, basic three knobs, maybe a little modulation, or are you liking the fact that a lot of this kind of uh, digital features are making its way over to the analog realm? Please write in the comments section below. That being said, I'll see you all soon. Take care and goodbye.